Our dear girls and boys, our candidates, you all come to yet another lesson in social studies. Today we are going to look at uh, the temperate climatic region. This climatic region is experienced in eastern parts of South Africa and the Ethiopian highlands. We looked at the climatic regions, so you can as well go back and review on that chart, that map of Africa, you will see where it's located. Now, in South Africa, uh, it is known as the high veiled. When we talk about the high veiled in South Africa, we are referring to the temperate climatic region in South Africa. It extends to the Drakensberg Mountains. Not the spelling of Drakensberg. Candidates, can you spell Dr Drakensberg? Thank you. Now, the high veiled is warm with the temperatures ranging between uh, 10 to 19 degrees Celsius. What are these countries that experience this type of climate? We have South Africa has the largest uh, area. We have Ethiopia and Lesotho. Now, in South Africa, it is experienced in uh, Transvaal, Natal, and Orange Free State. Now, what are the characteristics of the temperate climatic region? One, the temperature is moderate. It receives moderate rainfall during the summer. It has warm and wet summers and cool dry winters. Note this, it is described as what wet win what it is described as warm, wet summer and cold, dry winters. Now, what are some of the economic activities carried out in this region? We have one, mining, tourism, ranching, lumbering, dairy farming, crop growing, sheep rearing. Sheep rearing, this is basically the merino sheep. The merino sheep. So you must note the meaning of all these words. We have so far covered all these words, so uh, go through them and look at the meaning of all these words. Animals reared in this region include cattle. We have angora goats. This, these are basically for mohair and milk. They give a lot of milk. We have the merino sheep. These ones are basically for sheep and mutton. Now, what are some of the uses of more hair? More hair, we make nets. We also make sweaters, coats, and socks. Crops grown in this region. We have maize. We have barley. We have wheat. Potatoes. And sugar cane. So, when they talk about the temperate region, just know that talking about that uh, area in South Africa, that is a Transvaal, Natal, and Orange Free State, they're talking about Lesotho, they're talking about Ethiopia. Now, let us look at the same desert climate region. Same deserts are normally located near deserts. When you look at the Sahara Desert, that area near the Sahara Desert has this climatic region. When you look at the Namib Desert, then the Kalahari Desert, those areas around those deserts are the ones that experience uh, this same desert climate. Now, this area receives very little rainfall, less than 500 millimeters. Same deserts have low humidity due to little plant, little plant cover. What is the humidity, candidates? What is the humidity? Give me the answer. So, same deserts have low humidity. Countries with the 
same desert include South Sudan, Namibia, Zambia, Kenya, Niger, Mali, and the others. But you don't have any country in Africa that has only that type of uh, climate, but it's part of those countries. Like in South Sudan, the northern part. We look at Zambia, it's only part. Namibia part. Kenya, the north, uh, the northern part of Kenya. So, we are going to have an activity in our kabuku. That's from page uh, 141 to 142. Then also have planned for you work uh, besides this, we are going to have another exercise. I thank you so much. I wish you well.